Hello guys, this is Apex. Now today, we are in Feed the Beast once more. As... I still can't get over it. I spent so much time on my survival world. Survival world. But it got corrupted. It happened three times. And I just gave up on fixing it. But, uh... Basically, we found that mine that we were looking for. It's over there. Now we're in the cave, so there's caves all around here. Interestingly. And we are probably gonna start making a quarry. Cause and all these fancy things. Advanced circuit. Now the the advanced circuit looks like one of the more harder things to make. Honestly. I have no idea. Like this lapis, lapis right, lazurite dust. Oh, I guess you don't need lazurite dust, but you still need glowstone, so we're still gonna need obsidian to go to the Nether, unless there's some other way of making it, which I don't think there is. So I'll have to check up on that, cause the last place I want to go right now is the Nether, honestly. Alright, so, quartz crystal, let's see if there's, yeah, quartz, doesn't look like there's a use for this, oh wait, liquid detector, why would you need a liquid detector, green engineering brick, excoride, excorium, Oh, that's what excorium's for. Makes sense. So I guess it's not entirely useless. Now, I've been finding tons of these box... Or, uh... Oh, cinnabar. This is cinnabar. I found tons of bauxite ore. Bauxite and cinnabar look very similar. So confusion is quite common. But I've been finding a lot of these ores. In this mine, even. Not in the marble fisted one that we were in last episode. Or two episodes ago. Yeah, I guess it was last episode. No, it was two ago. I think. Yeah. Here's some white excorium. Extorium. Y torium. I have no idea how to pronounce. But it looks interesting. Can't wait to get into Thongcraft. <laughs> Oh, I forget. Thom. I know you need a table. Some sort of table. Uh, arcane workbench, I think. Table. Yeah, you need a table, so. Encased. Yeah, I, I don't know. Honestly. But once we get into Thomcraft, there will be lots of researching. It'll be good because Thomcraft, you can have all sorts of nifty things. Which is awesome. <coughs> and, uh, researching is kind of fun too because you get like a cauldron with water. You feel like a wizard in your little lab. You always make a cool looking lab. I don't know, it's, it's, it's quite cool. Now, mod packs are the most fun on servers because you can have like a train. Because in Feed the Beast, there's trains. Train. All these trains, like high speed trains, there's locomotives. Locomotive. All these locomotives. It's really. It's amazing how many things there are. And you can ha make a train station. Which is interesting because in my old server, I was just going to say this. Uh, I used to have a Mind Crack Pack server. Till <laughs> It was just for my friends. We just sort of milled around on there. But we had a train station, and it was cool. It had like 2,000 block long railways branching off to supply depots. It was kind of fun to role play with it. But, yeah. What is this? Looks like coal. Crude, oh, crude oil. Ah, that's cool. Make some oil. 
Alright, well, it looks like our inventory is getting filled up, so we're probably going to have to hit the top soon. And what sucks is in my survivor world. I keep referring to it as a survivor world. I have no idea why. In my survival world, I, uh, had... Oh, what's this? Oh, red excorium. It looks so valuable, but it's not. I had, uh, I think, in total, 100 levels of XP that I always died with. And I never had one enchanting table, I don't think. No, I'm pretty sure I didn't. So all those levels for nothing. And it's raining, so... Following the drill... We're gonna tone the sound down just a bit. Actually, that's a little... Too little. Um... Gonna make some more furnaces. Place them here. Okay. Start smelting some of these things. I wonder what crude oil turns into. Oh. What's this about? Crude oil. Hmm. Distillation tower. Oh, it looks like you keep it like this. Oh, it's the same thing as oil sands. That's neat. I think we're gonna need more chests soon as well. I assume so. Can you make... Yeah. Okay. <coughs> okay, so we also need more torches. Alright. So back to mining. Oh, I guess smelting would be finished so we can resume it. Smelt all the ores. Oh yes, I do have a bed. Okay, well that's unfortunate. Alright, so we're pretty low here. Should be expecting diamonds or something around here. It sounds like we're just above a cave. I can hear all the mobs. So... Hopefully it's not too dangerous down there. After all, all we have is a steel chest plate. <laughs> Monazit. What does Monazit do? Monazit. What? <laughs> okay. One is it ore for cesium. Interesting. I have no idea what that does, of course. But we might as well take it. Now I do think I have some monazit ore already upstairs. I believe so anyways. Um Okay. So it looks like well, there's a massive cave system over there, which we should probably... Oh, that's... Oh, I know what that is. So, see that huge ravine? That's where the mine is. And I guess the mine goes all the way around. We should really go check that out. Honestly. But, anyways, that concludes this episode, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you next episode.